It wasn't until actually graduate school that I had a professor who really helped me enjoy biostatistics, which is what I do now. Um, I had started uh, graduate school, a PhD program in biostatistics, and didn't even know anything about biostatistics. My first semester in school, I took a class called regression analysis. And regression analysis can be very boring. It sounds boring, right? Just putting a bunch of, you know, working on equations, um, trying to find the best line that fits through the data. It can, it can be kind of simple and, you know, you know, not too exciting. But my professor was an MD, PhD who was on an advisory board for the FDA. And an advisory board is when they're um, trying to, the FDA is considering approving a drug, but they want more advice from experts. So they might get experts in who are um, doctors, who are statisticians, who are scientists to talk about uh, the, the data and see whether or not um, they have some advice on whether or not they should approve the drug. And these advisory boards are open to the public. So you'll have patients coming to these advisory boards saying, I want my, I, I want to take this drug, please approve it. Or I want my father to take this drug, please approve it. And this drug was for heart failure. So my, my, um, my professor was a, a MD, a doctor who was actually familiar with heart disease. And he was a PhD in statistics. And so he was in a unique position to evaluate the data, the design of the data, and, and explain why maybe they were interpreting the data a little bit um, incorrectly and things like that. And so he was the sole dissenting opinion. He was the sole person who said on the panel, we should not approve this drug. And he was pretty vocal, and he would fight for it. And so he brought all that information to our class, and he'd say, what would you do in this situation? And how would you argue to approve this drug or not approve this drug? And so it was really this practical application of not just fitting a model with an or equation to the data, but saying, you know, this is how the, the company analyzed the data, and this is how I think of the data. This, how do you think of the data? How would you interpret the data? And whether, you know, it was just really exciting to see the application of what we do, what a statistician does, of how we make um, how we do what we do. And so for me, that was a, a real exciting moment. From that moment on, I knew I wanted to work in industry. I wanted to work in a pharma company or in biotech um, making those drug discoveries.